it appears in this world from an ultra wormhole. Nihiligo appears to be a parasite that lives by feeding on people and Pokemon. Alright, today is day a lot of my hunt for Nihiligo. I've been in ultra space for a few years now. I have this cap on to protect myself from Nihiligo. As the Pokedex states that it can suck life out of people and Pokemon. So that's why I have the uh, the Nature Valley Crunchy Bars. No one likes those. No one would ever eat those. So I'm hoping with this I should be safe. And as long as I'm a trusty partner, Mimikyu's on my side. Mimikyu! Oh my god, Mimikyu, no! Shiny Nihiligo. There it is. That's the Nihiligo. Right there. Woo! I hope it was captured well enough on camera. Because I'm not sure, exactly sure with this, or these two 3DSs, how well it appeared. But I'm gonna hope, I'm gonna hope that it appeared at least somewhat decently. All right, this took a long time. Uh, I, I have the number on my phone and I'm currently recording with my phone, so I'm gonna stop the recording and check how many encounters that was. All right, so this took 7,776 uh, or something similar, 7,576 or something like that. All right, so. Ultra Beasts, as we all know, are very, very difficult to get, and just, just some of the most difficult captures in the entire game. There's no specific ball that could be used to easily capture any beast, uh, Ultra Beasts, as they are very difficult to capture. Oh wow. Okay, I'm surprised. I thought, I thought it would stay, I'll be honest. Three shake. That's Neil Ego. Alright. Only like four more Ultra Beasts after this, because I have. Yeah, I have um, Guzzlord, which I'm going for next. And then Placephalon and Sakataka. And then Poipul. So. Yeah, only a few more. Ooh, the shiny Dex entry. That looks so good. That that looks so good. The shiny Dex entry. Let's go. I'm just gonna go with Glimmer, just because you know. Can't really think of anything else. Uh. Now let's go send it down to battle. Yeah. That's a really cool one to get. And I'm almost done. I'm definitely over halfway done with the Ultra Beast quest. All right, we're in Pony Wilds. And we got... Normal Furfru. And Glimmer, the shiny Nihiligo. That does look so good. The, oh, I forgot to save. That's, that's scary. I haven't saved yet. Yeah, it just it looks so good. I'm very glad I got the shiny, although it definitely took the longest so far out of all the Ultra Beasts. Because, like, all the other ones were, like, under rods, whereas this one was almost double. Which, I mean, I'm not going to complain. Going on, like, four files, I was doing, like, 115 minutes. So, can't complain. Normal K. And Glimmer. Nice. Yeah, that's neat, Leo. I, this 3DS does have a stylus, actually. One of the rare few. Yeah, that's a good knee, holy girl. Yeah. Alright, so yeah, this is a continuation of the Ultra Beast quest. From, like, five years... No, not even five. From, like, two years ago that I did. Because I most recently found the footage of the Celesteela and Kartana. 
which I uploaded before this, most likely at least. Because I haven't even started editing those at the moment. Yeah, so I found those footage, that footage, and then that inspired me to go back and continue the, uh, continue the quest for all the UBs. So, next is Guys Lord, whenever that decides to shine. And, um, yeah, other than that, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Gotta pet, pet it one more time. Little golden boy. Yeah.